The overall goal of this magnetic resonance guided focused ultrasound is to treat patients with medically refractory essential tremor by thermoablation of the ventral intermediate nucleus of the thalamus. This method will help us answer key questions in the field of neuroscience about less invasive treatments for treatment refractory essential tremor. The main advantages of this technique are that it's less invasive, feedback is immediate, and possibly more cost effective than other open neurosurgical approaches. Implications of this technique extends to treatment of other movement disorders such as Parkinson's disease. Our experiences with MR-guided focus ultrasound can provide insight about motor circuits inside the brain. Multidisciplinary teamwork is important for a successful treatment. The patient should be seen by a movement disorder specialist to determine suitability for this procedure. Before beginning the procedure, completely shave the head of the patient and check for scalp lesions. Have a neurosurgeon put the stereotactic frame in place and inject local anesthetic at the four pin sites. Place a rubber diaphragm on the patient's head to prevent leakage of the degassed water that circulates between the ultrasound transducers and the scalp and check the patient for metal pieces. Have the patient lie head first in the ultrasound helmet in the supine position and cover the patient with a warming blanket. Give the patient a stop button to allow pausing of the procedure at any time. Then, after performing a preliminary 3D localizer magnetic resonance scan and a T2-weighted sequence, contour any lesions on the scalp, calcifications in the brain or sinuses, and